Welcome to a rainbow on your plate. This is Chef G and today we're going to be going over the vegetables and fruits that you've been learning about. We're also going to test to see if you know the difference and we're going to get to look at how the different colors are the different vitamins and minerals that we need in our body. So let's get started. I'm going to reach into the bowl and first we have our little friend here. Now our little friend here, this is called a bell pepper. So I'm going to give you a second. So there you have our first vegetable, bell pepper. Then we have, ta da da a peach. What's a peach? If you chose fruit, you are correct. Fruits are sweeter than our vegetables. They're not as good for us because they tend to have a lot of sugars. Even though they're natural sugars, we want to avoid more of them than we would eat vegetables. So our plate should always have more vegetables than it does fruit. So, fruits. Now, this is an orange bell pepper. Decide. Should be pretty easy, right? Vegetable. It's a bell pepper. It's just an orange. And again, pretty much the same inside. So here it is. Do you think it's a fruit or a vegetable? If you said you don't know, that's a pretty good answer because you might not have ever had one of these. It's actually called the dragon fruit, which kind of gives away that it's a fruit, right? Isn't that crazy inside? Ta-da! What do you think? Small, it's bluish, and it's kind of sweet. Fruit or vegetable? If you said fruit, you are correct. It's a blueberry. Then, ta-da! Fruit or vegetable? Ta-da! It's red. He looks a lot like the other ones on this plate. Fruit or vegetable? No, it's not an apple. No, it's not a tomato. This is a red bell pepper. Then we have, ta-da! Everybody knows what this is. What, you don't? No, it's not a green apple. Look at the shape. This is a fruit or a vegetable. If you chose fruit, you're correct. This is a pear. Now, pears are a lot like apples. Now, oh, this, mm -hmm, great fruit. Fruit or vegetable? Oh, wait a second. Grapefruit, oh, I gave away the answer. Now these, are just kind of like a giant orange, right? Except for, what I like about these is they're kind of soury. I like the sour. Now, we have, ugh, you've been waiting for this? Mm-hmm. It looks like a minion. Yeah, if we stuck an eyeball and some little blue, you know, pants on him, he'd be a minion, right? This is actually called a spaghetti squash. So I'll give you a second to decide, fruit or vegetable. Now this one, I have to enjoy. Now, no, that wasn't very good. Not at all. Now, what's funny about these, there's a reason they call it spaghetti squash. And when you cook it, it actually pulls apart like spaghetti noodles. It's crazy. Now, mm-hmm, yeah, go ahead. You think? Vegetable? Fruit. Vegetable? Fruit. This is actually purple cabbage. If you said vegetable, you're correct! Yeah, when you cut it open, it's like lettuce. But in this case, it's purple. There are different colored cabbage. That's usually the green cabbage that you see. Now, 
This is the plum. Here we go. Slice. Open. Uh, you decide. Fruit or vegetable? It's a fruit. Then, onions. No, you know it's not an onion. They're grapes. Grapes come in a couple of different colors. You usually see the purple and the green, but there's light purple and dark purple, and there's like light green and yellowish kind of colors. This right here is one of my favorites. All right, so this is an absolutely colorful plate. We've got yellows, we've got greens, we've got purples, we've got oranges, we've got all different colors. These are what we talk about when we say that you need to have a rainbow on your plate. Always have fruit and vegetables with every meal. I know that's kind of hard sometimes, but dessert, fruit can be dessert. Vegetables, I know, you're saying, I don't like it when they cook my vegetables. That's all right, eat it, you know, fresh. You can crisp them. They're delicious to eat crisp. I prefer my vegetables uncooked. I'd rather have an uncooked vegetable than a cooked vegetable. And the funny thing is it's actually better for you when it's uncooked. So this has been a rainbow on your plate with Coach, wait, no, I forgot, Chef G.